Hi, in this section we will see how to make a simple image gallery using Dreamweaver CS4. Uh, I got a folder by name image gallery here and a subfolder with images. There we, I got two images here and they are of different size. I have to resize them first. I am going to open this in Photoshop. Let's check the size here. Image image size. Uh, they look too large. I am going to make this as 550. Okay. Now I need the width to 350 actually. So I am going to use crop here. And they should be of the size 550 width. And height should be 350. I'll start from here. Yeah, that will do. Crop, Control S. I'm saving the file. I'm going to open the second image. And we need to make sure both these images are of uh, similar size. So 550. And I'm going to use crop here with 550, 350. Yeah, crop. I'm going to save this one. Also need a smaller version of these pictures to have a thumbnail. Uh, image, image size. I'll make this as 70. File, save as. And large. I'll make this as thumb one thumb one and the second one image image size 70 will do file save as I name this as thumb two Okay, I'm done with Photoshop here. Now we got two large images of similar size and a smaller version of these two images here. Now I'm going to open Dreamweaver. I'm going to have a new HTML file. Create. Okay. Now we need a basic layout structure here to hold our images. I'm going to use div tag here. At start of the tag body, new CSS rule, compound based on selection. I'm going to use hash container. And here we need a new CSS style sheet. Okay. I'm going to give the name as style.css. and I'm going to set the size width to 550 and height to 500 position should be always relative apply ok uh, now we need a layer to hold our large images after the start of the tag container new CSS style Compound based on selection. I'll make this as img holder. Make sure style.css is selected here. And the box size 550, 350. Position relative. Okay, we got here. Now we need place to hold our thumbnails and that should be after the tag image holder new CSS style compound based on selection that will be thumb one make sure style.c is selected here and box which should be 70 I should be 45 position will be relative okay 
we got two images so we need one more thumb here after the tag this time it should be thumb one new CSS style compound based on selection hash thumb two style.css and box should be 70 45 position needs to be relative okay now we got a problem here thumb 2 went exactly at the bottom of thumb 1 we need in straight lines uh, so I'm going to go and check on my thumb 1 the properties here I'm going to add float the new property and that should be on the left here we go we get everything fine here I'm going to delete all these stuffs inside uh, we don't need these things here okay uh, now I'm going to insert a, a large image here insert image this one large I'll give this as large one large large will do and on the first thumb insert image we'll get thumb one here that's thumb one and then insert image thumb 2 thumb 2 ok uh, now we need to give the name here we need to select the large image one we will give the name as large id i mean select that i will give this thumb 1 and here select the thumb 2 and give this as thumb 2 okay now we need to use web images from behavior panel window behavior okay we got here I'll use swap images uh, for thumb one we need to swap the image uh, to s image large I'll just browse and select large one large okay that will do now I'm going to select the second one behavior um, swap images I'm going to select large again I'm going to select two large okay I'm going to save the file I'll give the name as gallery one HTML okay Let's see the output here okay as you can see here when I move my mouse over here it changes I didn't do it properly but that's the concept Thanks for your time guys.